Hello guys, I was going to kind of show you how to hook the Thunder Drive up to the Rear Admiral Hyperdrive system. It's an actual Lieutenant clone made by MyTech Electronics in the USA. Um, it hooks up just like a Lieutenant Colonel and you get this device. This is your hard drive. I got a zip drive 100 hooked up here. Backing up my files, so I was going to show you how to properly hook up a, a Zip 100. So you got your pretty much proprietary cable that goes up to your back of your hard drive. So we're going to climb up here, and on the back of your um, hard drive, you'll notice um, the cord that goes with the hard drive will plug in the bottom, and then the top one will be an actual regular Centronics to a 25 pin cable so you'll need to buy one of those and then that goes into that port on your um, zip drive okay so when we go down to here when you hook the stuff up have all the power cords unhooked I highly recommend it because I've fried every you know the hard drive before but have all the stuff unhooked before you start plugging in data cables on the back of your drive you're going to want these two switches flipped in the bottom position so you should be on SCSI device 5 with your terminator on and then you take your zip disk pop her in the oven Turn on your Commodore. When you turn it on, you're going to see the light flash, I think, twice. And then we're going to get our power up. To actually access the zip drive, I believe it don't kick in on the first try. When you do a DIR. So, you hit the lovely run, stop, and restore. So since I only have one hand, I'll do my best. And I'll do a DIR again. And there's our files. Um, the zip drive works through six through nine. So there's our um, sub bases and email. Click on here at UD areas two. Eh, that one's empty. Oh, that's on the zip drive. Yeah, so nine probably. We have nothing on it either. Um, when you're reading blocks, just remember 37 is double that. 272 is double that used. So that's, you know. Well, over 500 blocks but that's how you do it man just make sure absolutely sure when you hook this up from the rear admiral to your zip drive it goes in the diamond plug because if you plug it in the zip drive plug you will not have a rear admiral hard drive anymore <laughs> which is a rookie error and also make sure when you install this dude and it's got jumpers in there that goes into the Commodore. Um, my other one is not set up right now or I'd show you. But do not install the jumpers while it's powered up. So I hope you enjoy it, man. And this is a demo on the Rear Admiral Hyperdrive from iTech Electronics. Six years later after it was made. So y'all have a good one and enjoy it.